As part of a government-led initiative to enhance the leadership capacity of state-owned enterprises, directors on the boards of several statutory bodies will engage in a director's education and accreditation program deep from February 14 to 16, 2023. This initiative fulfills the government's commitment to ensure that all directors are duly trained, certified and accredited to effectively carry out duties as directors within a year of appointment. The Advanced Director Training Course facilitated by the Eastern Caribbean Securities Exchange and the Chartered Governance Institutes of Canada will be delivered on a rolling basis to all statutory bodies focusing on the strategic areas of governance for directors, finance for directors and, strate and strategy and risk management. Chairman of the Citizenship by Investment Committee, Mr. Richard Duncan, said the course will ensure that members of statutory boards are adequately trained to develop or hone the requisite skill sets, enabling them to effectively exercise the degree of professional oversight required to state-owned entities. Jason Phillip, one of the directors at Financial Complex Limited, welcomes the initiative that he says will enable him to make a positive input in decision making, as this is his first time serving on a government board. Phillip says it is important to have an understanding as to what it means to be a director. It is very important that you set policy and that you're able to govern, whether it be a company, entity, agency, whatever the nature of the company is. And um, it is very important for directors to be certified to an international standard. And that is what it comes back to. We need to understand that regardless of where you serve, um, when it comes to boards, um, that there are similarities regardless of the nature of what the business does. And that governance is what boards do. And um, you, we need to keep up with international standards. We need to understand what are the mandates required to ensure that management does what it has to do. And so this particular training course is very important to ensure that we, the directors on that board, have the full understanding and the capability to be able to govern and create policy that will positively affect the management of the um, business. Simon Lewis is a director on the National Water and Sewage Authority Board. She too welcomes the training. It's important because it is to prepare us as directors for the important role we are expected to play in the governance of the organizations we were selected to serve on and to further educate us as directors in corporate governance. The training will also be an effective way for us to obtain a good insight into our role as directors, as we will be furnished with the knowledge of key areas related to that role. Hi, St. Jeremiah and David Bruno, who has been selected to serve on the GIDC and Grand Lake boards respectively, says while this is not their first time serving as a director, government's initiative to equip them with the requisite knowledge needed to execute their duties is welcomed. I think TM training is, is very important. It makes the DM um, directors aware of what the rules are, um, what are the responsibility as a director, and, and what is their role in relationship to the, um, the um, management of the organization. This is not my first um, stint on a government board. I have been on the Greek, on the Grenada Airport, Airport Authority um, um, board and before, but um, there wasn't no oh, them training or, or, or anything like that. They just um, put you on the board and they ask you to serve. But um, I think um, um, giving you the training and before you take up the role as director would equip you in order to perform your role as effective as possible. What that would mean is that at least you would <clears throat> be more equipped in terms of having formal training to execute your duty. So um, at least you will have better directorship on, on, on boards, um, stronger boards, um, board that will serve its purpose, etc. And as someone who has served on boards before, would you encourage others, they may not be on the same board that you're mm -hmm. serving, because mm -hmm. uh, this is the first cohort of training, mm -hmm. there are plans to have more, mm -hmm. would you encourage them to put themselves forward for such? Certainly. Any, anything that can improve your skill set, you should grasp, grasp it. 
The DEEP is expected to provide a forum for a frank, inclusive and insightful discussion on key aspects of governance, standards and principles, including the duties and responsibilities of a director and the legal ramifications of being a director.